guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you how to download real life call mods into BeamNG on your iMac. Now you're probably like me, scrolling to YouTube, trying to find a video on how to download the mods for your BeamNG on the iMac. And the only thing that popped up for related to iMac and BeamNG was how to get the game on iMac. Now, today, I will be showing you and helping you on how to get real life call mods into BeamNG. Let's do it. Here's some tips and tricks to help you not have a broken game or anything bad. So, a web real source that everybody likes to use is called modland.net. is an awesome site. I've used it many times for my mods. Now, be careful with the mods. Some can break or infect your game or even not show up and make your game really laggy. So one very important thing to do is making sure that the iMac does not unzip the files because the calls, the mod calls, or the base calls that come with the game all zip files. So what you're going to do is go to the Foley, click it, go to settings, and then get to the general tab. Stay on the general tab, go down here, and turn off open safe files. Turn, turn this off, and now the zip file that you download are going to say zipped and not going to turn them into a folder. Alright, so what you're going to need to do now is find the mod. Now, I've already picked the mod. I'm going to download this cool Dodge Ram 1500 TOX. Now, what you're going to do, go to TOX, go to download right here. Wait a few seconds, unless you log in. Then you're going to go to TOX. Now, this is a trusty one I like to do, mods file. Okay, go straight to the point. Now, what you got to do is got to be quick, otherwise, it's going to pop up a bunch of guys and it's going to take you there. Like that. So what you want to do is go straight to it. Now wait a while for it to download. I can see it might take a little while. Now I'm going to go to your downloads. You want to press the show and find the one on your download. It will pop up this. We're going to go to Steam. We're going to right click on BMG. We're going to manage browse local files. Then we're going to double click on content. Double click on calls. This is where your file paths are stored. So you're going to want to memorize this or you can just copy it. Okay, so since Steam is emulated and it's on iMac, it's going to be a little tricky and this is the most hardest part. You got to go to users, your profile, then you have to go to library, application support, crossover, bottles, Steam, and drive. Then program files. Steam again. Then Steam apps. Common. Steam and drive. And then content. Vehicles. And those are vehicles. And inside the vehicles folder, this is what you're going to need to drop the mod you just downloaded. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take all TLX. We're going to drop it in there. I want to make a shortcut to the BMG vehicles. So, what I do is you make a folder and that will take you directly to it next time you download a mod. You want to go to your vehicles, you want to right click, you want to press make alias. There's your vehicle's alias, you go to it, and now there's all your calls. Now, what I recommend doing is putting this alias on the home page of your Mac. Now you're going to want to drag it to your desktop. Now that we moved our zip file to the BeamNG structural, now we can start playing the game. Now since we have loaded into the game, you want to check that all your maps are there, base maps and mod maps. As you can see, all our maps are there, so none of our mods or new mods has, has affected the game. Now we're going to load into a map really quickly. I'm using my new for three more for one in map. Now that you have loaded into your BMG map, you're going to now spawn the call. Scroll down to where your mod is. As you can see, it is right here. Successfully in. I'm just going to spawn this one. It looks cool. You're going to wait a little bit for it to load. Alright, so now you have successfully downloaded your BMG mod into the game. Have fun with it. Crash it. Do whatever you want. I don't care. It's your mod. If this helped you, I would love for you to like. If you're feeling very generous and it helped you so much in the future, then I would love you to 
subscribe. I guess the Matt told you I did it, and I love that I did. I'll see you soon in the next video. Have a great time.